Hey guys, today I'm going to be going over some smokes for both the A site and the B site on Inferno. And starting right off here to smoke off the art side of mid, you simply want to line yourself up with just about to the left side of this broom right here, just enough so you're not exposed to mid. Doesn't have to be perfect. And aim at this wire right here and simply throw. And it should bounce off a couple of walls and land right where the CTs would stand to view mid. And to smoke off the other side by quad, you just want to line yourself up with the edge of this ivy right here. And you want to aim just to the left of this flower pot right here where the corner is and throw. And boom, smokes off the quad side and it even covers boiler so nobody can kind of pop out right there. And to smoke off in front of pit on the A site, you simply want to line yourself up with the corner of this wall right here and aim just to the left of this line right here is pretty much dead center between this post and this post. So right about here and at the height of this antenna. And then you just want to do a regular throw. And it should bounce a couple of times and land right about there and block off anybody playing inside of pit from seeing you. And to smoke off the archway itself, you simply want to come into the middle of the ivy right here, aim at the corner of this roof, up to the height of this, and throw. It should bounce and land right in the middle of the archway like so. And to smoke the cross in front of pit, if you're doing an air wrap and have arch smoked, you simply want to come into this corner right here by the cubby hole, aim at this post right here and just go up a little bit and do a regular throw. And it should bounce off the graveyard wall and land right at the cross like so, so you can cross safe without being picked by pit. And now onto the B side of things, first and foremost you smoke off the cross for CT. You simply want to line yourself up with the edge of the logs right here, like so. And you want to aim at the tip of this scaffolding right here, up to the height of the wire. It's almost the same lineup as before, just a little bit slightly to the left, and instead of using the chimney, you use scaffolding and it smokes off the cross like so. And to smoke off what was formerly spools and is now called coffins, I guess, you simply want to line yourself up with the edge of these longer bricks right here. You want to aim just to the right of this grouping of leaves right here, so there's the bigger, fatter ones, and then this smaller, pointy one. So aim just to the right of it, and throw. And it should bounce off the edge of that one, and smoke it off. And any offers sitting like right here should not be able to see you unless they jump on top of those, I almost said spools, on top of the coffins, and expose themselves. And hey guys, a little bit of a bonus smoke that I didn't include in the main video because it is a little bit harder to do than, well, the rest of the smokes. It takes quite a bit of practice to get consistent, but I figured I'd include it anyways, and it's a very useful smoke for when you're doing a mid to B take. So you simply want to line yourself up with the middle of this door right here. And you want to aim just to the left of this post right here, up to the height of the second tier of the bell tower, and do a tap W throw. And as you can see, it smokes off in front of a library and the corner right there. And there isn't really any gaps in it either, but again, I didn't include it in the main part of the video because it is a little bit more difficult to master. It took me a while to get the lineup perfect, but there you have it. There are some smokes for the new Inferno. And as always, thank you all very much for watching and see you next time.